How's it going guys? My name is Butters. We're here today playing Batman the Telltale series. Now this came out today in New Zealand. Came out a couple of days, maybe yesterday or the day before in the States. So you've probably seen multiple videos on it, but I'd like to thank you personally for clicking on my video. Um, I try not to talk during the important things, but let's get to it. I haven't gotten into any of it by the way. I haven't touched any of it. I just started up right now. Get into it. So one. Yeah, so there's only one episode that I know that's out. Bruce Wayne navigates the trainers. Orders of Gotham politics as a series of shocking allegations surface while Batman confronts Gotham's most notorious crime boss. And that picture right there just tells a million stories. It looks so sexy. Alright, let's get to it! This is really loud. Oh yeah! Oh! Back tech color. Oh, that's freaking awesome! What should we do? Blue is obviously the standard color. I'm gonna go for red. Because it's something new. Yep. I didn't think it would take this long to load. The depths of the choices you make, the story is tailored by how you play. This is probably going to fail tremendously, mate. Tremendously. I just moved everything around so I got to make sure it's perfect. I'm going to lose my shit. Ooh. Wayne Tower looks amazing. It looks so pretty. Hey, what are you? Oh fuck! Was not expecting that. Holy shit! My god! My crazy god! Get it open. On it. Hey, you think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. I really fucking doubt that. That's... This is awesome! <sighs> you can see his brains on the ground. Move in! Hey, Gordy. Cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. For all the other flying animals. Mm. Oh, there he is! What are we gonna do? Oh! The fuck is that, bro? Huh? Seven, bro! Oh. oh, this is not going to go well. Oh, look at those eyes. Oh. Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. No one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed, the city is safer now. But it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shut out of the sky. Criminals in this city. <laughs> they need something to fear. 
Oh, he go fuck. Oh. Shit. Where'd you? Jill, where'd you go, Jill? Whatever got in, don't let it get out. I'm not very good with quick time events. No. I'm terrible. What's that? Oh, so that's so easy. Gas masks on. <coughs> Why won't I go? That's not terrifying, then what the fuck? Oh, shit. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, I missed that one. Ah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ah. Oh, I'm not gonna quick time event. I'm not gonna keyboards. I totally pressed the wrong. Oh shit. Oh what? Oh Knock the fuck out. <laughs> Where'd the other guy go? Oh hey. Oh, hey. Teach you to knock. Hey babe. How you go? Behind you, big boy. Heyday. Hey, hey, where are you going? Intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Wow. Damn, Selena. You got a fine ass cat is, because I love those cats. Without a scratch. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell this, me that's why you do this all this. This way was Yay. Squeeze into a suit. Tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. Gotham needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me, what? A villain? Sounds fun. Got it, panic. Though. Sorry. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. 
Then let's put you in a cage. Bring it, Bat. Oh, this is gonna be... Whoop! 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 Yeah. Whoop! Oh, oh. I'm not... I'm not good at, um... Laugh was ridiculous. I'm sorry. Who are now? Jesus! Got it. Wait! 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 Do not shoot! trouble for this. Ha! Psych you out! A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. God damn it! I said don't shoot! No! Wait! Oh, 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 she fell off the edge! What the fuck? What if I don't catch her? The stress is so real! I got you, bitch! I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. <laughs> Don't struggle or you'll fall. No, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know oh. men like you. Oh. Bye, Bat. <laughs> <laughs> what a bitch. You stole my shit! Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Oh, that's a good line. Well then. Time to save the city. There you go. That was that was a wow. Wow. That was a good way to start a game. Holy shit. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. 
and even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. But for too long, this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. A man speaks the truth! If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Enjoy drinking my wine. It's worth more than most of you. <laughs> no, he's oh, funny. shit, that was too brutal. That's too brutal. No wine is that expensive. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. I thought that'd just be a cute joke. Together, we will change Gotham. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. They want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. I'll do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible <laughs> at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. Which, for the record, I have not been since before law school. All right, all right, all right. How about uh, a new face for Gotham? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm going to use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. The fuck are you, mate? You're a bit late. You're a bit late, mate. Well, fuck it. So they Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. <laughs> I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Uh, this city's luster that. faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding golden age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a Wrong. dangerous Just mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent is our best shot. Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes and that grin will win him over. 
He's gonna need more than that, son. Oh, it hasn't been 15 minutes yet, Bob. We've still got time. Uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city... You guys look so guilty. ...to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway. It was terrible. Truly terrible. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Uh, yes, well, that was a long time ago. I've moved on. Of course, of course. Together, we'll help the whole city move on. Jesus Christ. Not saying I doubted you, but that went better awesome. than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, he certainly doesn't have any time either. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. Thanks. Bruce? This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. So formal. Call me Bruce. Oh, you swanky well, motherfucker. <laughs> Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. Oh, have but I? How are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Huh? I'm doing better now that you are here. Well, I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't around, I'd give you the private tour. Mr. Wayne, you've you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah, it looks like. Oh, this? No, it's nothing. It's just uh cut myself shaving. What, your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. Yeah. Do excuse Bruce, me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. The fuck are you? Oh, there you go. Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. See you later, babe. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham. For all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I don't like this, Harv. But I'm trusting you. Thank you, Bruce. <coughs> Seriously. You know I have to pull every string I can to get elected. Yeah, well, I'll just make sure this one doesn't hang you. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. He's just a businessman, and I think it's all gonna be all good. House. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. It's silly! I think I'll take it. So, Sullivan, I want you Though the decor offends my eyes. <laughs> Man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? <laughs> I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Come, but, you know, Come on, Froka. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. You're a respectable man, I hear. Ah, fuck! Bruce Wayne. I know who you are. The guy who's gonna sell me his house. Damn it! 
Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlour. Follow me, if you will. Fuck! Who's better to piss off? The guests that control the in like everything that everyone will say about Bruce Wayne? You Mayne? should know, Mr. Falcone. Or the guy that could probably My kill him. say we're raising triple well, with Mayor Hill. Hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce? You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever you... Ah, ah, what did I say? Suck my dick. That's what I said. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say it he will. The man talks too much, chaps my face with words. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, Mr. Falcone, I... No more warnings. Seems I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Oh, fuck yeah. off. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happens to being a gracious host. I ain't your bitch, bro! Okay, imagine. This is me. This and is these you? are all my this friends. This is my finger. The businesses, mm -hmm. restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home. Hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Oh. Now, we got a good thing going, so I don't see why we shouldn't team up. Pretty keen to be a Look, dick. I'm only talking to you because Harvey asked. Trusting a friend to know what's best for Gotham. Now that's a predicament. You listen to me, kid. Oh. I know, somewhere inside that tuxedo, you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. Beat the shit out of him. And which to break. Whatever you say. You're a good kid. You look like him, you know? <sighs> it's nice that we understand each other. Fuck, I want to knock this guy out. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Hey, I appreciate I the hospitality, Mr. Wayne. But I, uh... <laughs> I don't think I'll put an offer on the house. A nice guy like you should have a nice place to live. I'll be seeing you, Bruce. While this city's still standing. I'll be shoving my foot up your ass real soon, bro. Holy shit, that was amazing! My God, Jesus, is that it? Don't, don't be. Please don't be it. Or is that just the intro? Is that just the intro? Because I'd be really happy if it was. Come on, I didn't finish. Don't finish. Don't finish. <laughs> How long this goes on? Oh, what's the back cave look? What's the back cave look like? What's the back cave look like? Turn the fucking camera around! Oh! Woo! 
Fuck it, hey! That was just the intro! Holy shit! It's been 30 minutes! Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GC... Whoa, you just have them sitting there like that? Fuck, that's depressing. Why are there only two? Shouldn't you be free? You and your mum and your dad? Custody this evening after a break in at City Hall. The notorious Batman was on the scene, but failed to secure the stolen items. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Oh, my God.